Hello, dear students. I am Samir Velankar. I welcome all of you to this seventh video on recursive functions. Well, this video, from this video onwards, we will see some practice questions on recursion. We will see some gate questions also. And in the previous six videos, we saw six very interesting examples on recursion and we understood fundamentals of recursion. So it is very necessary for all the students to first watch and understand those six previous videos and then come to this particular example. So the question asked here is what is the output of this program? And as you see, fun, fun is the function called from here as fun3 and 3 is the parameter passed to this fun function where n will be 3 initially. So let's run this function as usual as we had been running. Fun starts with parameter n and n is 3. For n equal to 3, check this, for n equal to 3 here, when n is 3, this if statement will be false as n equal to 0 is false. So else is going to run which says that the function at this point of time should return should return check the statement should return 2 into 2 into fun n minus 1. So the function should return 2 multiplied by fun n minus 1. Now n being in this case n being 3 n minus 1 is going to be 2. So the function fun 3 should return this answer isn't it but this is a recursive call. So fun 2 gets called n is the parameter.